John Wool, some good news. No reported deaths and no loss of structure, but some not so great news is when we first came out here, we were told about 100 acres have burned. Now we're at about 500 with only 25% containment. Now this is the San Gabriel Fire in Liberty Hill. I'm told the fire started at 2200 Tower Road and moved northeast. Now officials have it stopped at FM 3405. I'm told it will not be contained tonight, so they're going to continue to fight this fire overnight and into tomorrow. So far, no threat of crossing over the highway. No word on the cause of the fire yet. 22 agencies from around the state responded. Now we saw huge air tankers dropping retardant and helicopters with buckets filling up in Lake Georgetown and then dropping water on the land there. I'm told the hot, wa hot weather, dry conditions, and the wind is making it difficult to fight, and it's been like this for a couple weeks now. A representative from Texas and Fire Services says 90% of fires are caused by humans and preventable. Preventable. In the past seven days, they've responded to about 205 wildfires and continue to fight this one tonight. So while the forward progression of the fire may have been halted, they won't up that containment until they are very solidly sure that there is no threat to that line and there is no chance of that fire escaping and starting another fire or moving forward. I'm told about 200 homes were evacuated earlier this evening, but at this time, all evacuees are allowed to return home. We'll keep you updated online and on the air. Stay with us. But for now, reporting live in Williamson County, Meredith Aldis, Fox 7 Austin News.